Hi friends, this is Sheshan Andredi from Aerotech Solutions. So I just want to give a brief information on this embedded system course flow. So how you are giving training on embedded system to the engineering students depends on the course structure you can get opportunities on different levels. So in my organization, I'm just giving training this flow. I want to explain. There, there is a three level course we are doing. The first level is firmware engineer. And second level is internet of things. And third level, which is device drivers. So these levels will help to the engineering students so what they studied in engineering which starts with the fundamentals from processors controllers and c language the first level firmware so the skill set which covers c language and data structures so here we are giving the strong we are building strong fundamentals in C language with Linux platform and also there is a strong foundation with data structures and in this same level you are going to give embedded C programming language with all microcontrollers there are different microcontrollers in the field like 8051 PIC microcontrollers, AVR and Arduino. So these basic microcontrollers you will get complete exposure with embedded C programming and microcontrollers combination. And also we will give training on protocols which are UART, I2C, SPI and you have CAN data frame we can give knowledge up to data frame and you are allowing to students to do more projects on these different interfacings sensors keypad lcds motors and there are some all serial modules including bluetooth gsm gps so all these different interfacings you are allowing to do in this first level and this level you are allowing to all engineering students which are passed out or running students who are doing pursuing the engineering or mtech so even they can do short term course as two level two months duration for this all candidates are eligible who have electronics fundamentals and the duration you are taking 45 days and you will take daily 3 hour sessions. So there are two separate sessions, one for controllers and other session with language. So even engineers can get job opportunities with this level but the pay skills are very less the compared to high level skill set. So this is the first level in embedded system course flow second level which is internet of things here you are giving training on 32 bit devices as we will start with ERM processor architecture the most popular ERM version processor 7 and 9 and their complete architecture about bus architecture and registers and operating modes so all this knowledge you can take from this ARM architecture and also we will give one controller which is designed with ARM 7 core as LPC 2148 so you can take even other series controllers also so this will help a lot you like what what kind of approachment you can follow for understanding 32 bit controllers Next, we will give on Python programming language with the same module because the languages which are updated in industry 
as C and Python. But most of the core industries deals with these two programming languages. Either they will take C or C++ and nowadays most popular programming language is Python which also integrated with this embedded domain and you are giving ERM 9 based target board which is Raspberry Pi we will give all the modules training here then how to grab the internal modules of this Raspberry Pi target board including Ethernet, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth GPIO programming all these experiments you can do with this combination by learning pro Python programming language so and also we will begin this cortex processors overview in this second level of embedded system course flow and for this who are working in firmware they are eligible to join this module who completed even engineering because they are also aware of this terminology but they are not aware of how to do practically these concepts and duration is 45 days even for this module if you want to take this course you are completing with 45 days daily 2 hours 1 hour for language and other sessions for controller based applications this is our second level of embedded system course the third level which is device drivers and here we will give we will start operating system so the operating system overview and as well as the complete operating system internals the fundamentals of operating system we will give complete lectures on these concepts and we will start embedded Linux with system programming, network programming and how to build a kernel by in Linux platform and also we will work with the standard target board we have BeagleBone and we will do some e applications with this and we are allowing to show the examples of drivers and for this we are working in core field with the startup companies they are eligible to join this level and this will help a lot to extend their career in this embedded domain so this is one time skill set which required for the engineer and who are working in embedded industry which will help a lot and for this you are allowing same duration with two hour sessions daily so this is our approachment and who wants to join the entire course you can take three levels or else if you want to join module wise you can you can so we are giving training with the different modes of training so total duration is 135 days you are allowing two candidates per day three hours even you are supporting for online and also classroom So there are many companies which are working with this platform. So there are topmost MNCs companies. They have they are offering good packages with this embedded skill set. And there are different roles to grab as an engineer. Whereas beginning level trainees or hardware engineers or junior engineers, embedded test engineer. This is our entry level job roles as a core engineer. But once you are getting experience in this platform, so you you can offer you can grab global opportunities across the world. So this is our address to communicate with us. So even uh, you can follow Google Maps. So you are located very near to KPHP Metro Station and you can follow this contact number 9676327118 and this is my mail id if you have any doubts just ping in whatsapp or mail us thanks for watching